Well, as luck would have it, I hit the wrong button, so this is going to be two separate videos. But you can see, once the uh, passenger side was anchored to the ceiling, then I clamped my level across the top to, you know, induce, I guess if you will, a planar element uh, across both sides. I still have my piece down here on the floor, which is uptight, and then I clamped a diagonal that's running across and it's touching that basically all the way and then i ran the screw in here and then i'll have to uh um, disconnect all this stuff and put the screw in on the other side and then i believe you can see where this right here where like where that is screwed i'm gonna put a, a, a bracket on both sides there and you know it'll still have a little movement in there but that's fine um, just to kind of anchor it down so that's kind of where we're gonna end up and you know again it's not perfect this this side fits a little bit better than that side but uh, you know there there may be some additional trim at some point but that's uh, where we're going for right now all right everybody I do have my there's the piece cut for the other side of this closet right here you know so that piece will run right along that strip and divide the kitchen if you will from the from the uh, closet and that should be a nice that'd be a pretty nice size closet so there may be i may leave a full length area you know where you could hang a couple of coats or something if you needed to and then the rest would be shelves what have you so we're getting there all right everybody have a great day